Hey everybody, welcome to Heat My Shorts. Hope you're all doing well today. I've got Toon's Smoky Chipotle Hot Sauce to review today for a second time. I've reviewed this before. But before I, before I get to this, I just want to wish a happy Father's Day to all the dads and father figures out there. Appreciate you. Appreciate you, father, my dad, and all dads out there doing your part to raise your children or even somebody else's children, or even pets. Happy Father's Day, everyone. You're awesome. And happy Sunday to everyone, everyone. You're awesome. So let's get to this. Toon's Smoky Chipotle Hot Sauce. Now, like I say, I have already reviewed this once before, a couple years ago, probably. But Toon actually was kind enough to reach out to me after one of... The previous reviews, I believe, or maybe it was just out of the blue, I forget for sure, but either way, reached out and wanted to send me his newest sauce to review and sent a bottle of each of the others as well. So that was super awesome of him. I really appreciate that. And of course, I'm gonna go ahead and review them again because that's just such a nice gesture. The, the least I can do is spread the word and re-review the sauce again. So. Let's get to it. This is small batch brewed smoky chipotle from Vancouver, BC, Canada. I do have a little pull tab here. It's got a little perforation there, so I don't even need to bring the knife out. There's a lot of times. That's, this isn't the first time that I've ever seen a hot sauce with a perforated shrink wrap, but it's also just a little awkward to get the knife into that little area there. So let's give this a good shaky shake before we open it up. And I suppose it's a good time to track down the spoon case. Get the hot sauce tasting spoon out before we open this up. There we go. Using my wooden spoon that I got from Jay's Hot Sauce. So... A different kind of hot sauce, Toon's Hot Sauce, small batch brewed in Vancouver, BC, Canada. Here's the ingredients, chipotle chilies, onion, tomatoes, garlic, ginger, vinegar, salt, sugar, mushroom extract, edible starch, spices, nucleotide seasoning, and yeast extract. Now I'm going on memory here, but nucleotide seasoning, I believe, is that umami flavor, I believe, or maybe that's the mushroom extract. I should have looked this up beforehand. I didn't. It's before, it's it's early in the morning here. It's before 8 a.m. actually, but I wanted to get this video done early, so I didn't do a whole bunch of research. Look at her. Are you watching me? Are you listening? You're a good girl. How am I doing? Am I doing all right? What a cutie. Anyways, so have a look at the sauce. It's a nice looking sauce for sure. Really nice reddish orange color. Yeah, kind of a rust color. Can definitely see some pieces of ingredients in there, some chunks. Some decent sized chunks in there too. I'm not sure if that's the garlic. Either way, it's it's something. It's something that's in there. Let's open it up. Ooh, nice little pop there. There we go. Now, this lid. Oh, here we go. Put it right in the blue grocery box thing. Let's grab a scoop of this stuff. Here's what it looks like on the spoon. Mm -hmm. Let's try this out. From Toon's Hot Sauce in Vancouver, BC, Canada. This is Smoky Chipotle Hot Sauce. Heat my shorts. Mm. Yeah, that's really good. I suppose we could give it a proper pour like this. Because I won't dip the spoon in for a second serving and contaminate the bottle. I might want to share this with someone. And it pours surprisingly well out of that wide mouth jar bottle thing. 
Mmm. Very nice, creamy consistency. It's nice and salty, but not overly salty. Very nicely balanced. Mmm. There's so much flavor going on there, it's delicious. Absolutely delicious. Pretty mild in regards to the heat level. Very mild. Flavor rating. Okay, and I have to be honest. I almost looked up my old review of this to see what I gave it for a flavor rating last time. Just so that I was consistent with my rating. But that's cheating. That's not honest. That's that's not an honest review then. So I didn't do that. I, I'm going into this and I'm going to give this today's flavor rating, which very well could be, probably is different than what I gave it last time, just because tastes change, our preferences change, taste buds change. So I'm going to give this a flavor rating of 9 out of 10. This is absolutely delicious. If you like that savory sort of, is savory the right word? I think it is. Salty, umami sort of a mushroom extract sort of a flavor. If that sounds good to you. It's got a tomato-ish flavor to it too. I'm pretty sure it has tomatoes in it. Oh yeah, it's like the third ingredient in. Garlic, yeah, definitely garlic. I'm not really getting the ginger specifically, but there is a variety of spices in there, so it just kind of all works really well together. Really good. I think the edible starch is probably a thickener, but I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna give this a 9 out of 10 for a flavor rating. It's absolutely delicious. I really like this stuff. Oh, there's a good thumbnail with Maggie too. Right, Maggie? You're a good girl. Yeah. <laughs> um, my heat? I think I'll give this a 1 out of 10. It's pretty much just on the tip of the tongue. A slight tickle, almost like a fuzziness on the tip of the tongue there. Maybe a, a little bit of warmth in the throat, but I wouldn't even call it a burn or really even a tickle, just a sensation. Very mild. If you're at habanero level, you could call this a maybe a 2 out of 10. That might be generous. It's hard to say. If you're at jalapeno level, maybe something like a 4 out of 10. Maybe a 5. Slight lower lip sting is just creeping in now. Very, very slight. Like, barely detectable. But it's there. I would absolutely restock this. This is a delicious sauce. I forgot how much I liked this. I haven't had a bottle of it in a while, actually. It's delicious. I highly recommend checking this out. Now... As far as parrots, okay, now again, I have to be honest with you, I wrote down a couple of parrots ahead of time because I am familiar with this sauce, so that gave me some time to think about it. So I wrote down soups, stews, sandwiches, rice dishes, and chicken. That's what I wrote down. I think I wrote that down last night. <laughs> That's what I would suggest par parroting this with. Um, but really, honestly, all sorts of things, pastas, veggie dishes, on pizza it would be great. Even use this as a base sauce, like a pizza sauce for your pizza. That would be great. Start with the dough, put this on it, and then put your toppings and cheese on that. That'd be really good. A meat lover's pizza, even a veggie pizza, a deluxe. Yeah. <clears throat> that just kind of came to me. I might have even suggested that on the previous video. I don't know for sure. But anyways, once again, Thank you very much, Toon. I really appreciate you gifting... Oh, I almost fell off the ramp there. <laughs> I'm standing on Maggie's ramp. I really appreciate you gifting these bottles of hot sauce to me here and sending them for free. Much appreciated. Really appreciate these products and your support, your encouragement. Thank you very much. Um, I suppose I'll just put this in the handy little grocery basket too. We'll have a little hangout with Maggie before we sign off here. Right, Maggie? Do you want this one? You actually look quite content with no toy at all, which is maybe not rare, but 
She definitely loves her toys. Right. What, now you're not going to look at the camera now that I'm here hanging out? Huh? Hmm? <laughs> yeah, this is your time. Yeah, this is your portion of the video. Yeah. You got wet spots all over your head from the wet grass. A little bit of rain overnight. I actually thought it was going to rain for this video. I have the umbrella handy. It's just at the back door, but looks like we didn't need it. Very, I think we got a couple of drops throughout the video here, but nothing to worry about. Oh, you're so cute. You're so cute. Yeah, what a good girl. Anyways, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. Thanks for hanging out with us. Hope to see you on the next one. Thank you very much, Toon. A whole bunch of magpies just flew over. That was cool. Um, I lost my train of thought there. Thank you for hanging out with us. I hope to see you on the next one. This has been Heat My Shorts with Maggie and Steve, The Maggie Show, and Toon's Smoky Chipotle Hot Sauce. Love you all. Have a great day. Bye-bye.